And if you haven't voted just yet, the polls are still open. Poll workers introduced the new poll pads with today's election day. Our Tom Kowalski spent the day at various Erie County polling places to find out how these new poll pads are working and also get a gauge on voter turnout. Tom, what did you find out? Yeah, Mike and Eva, good evening. Now I've got some good news and I've got some bad news here. Now the good news is that the polling pads seem to have gone off without a hitch from what I understand. Nothing negative has been reported to us that we know of. Now, the bad news, I've said it before, I'll say it again, voter turnout has been incredibly low. Uh, polling places that I've spoken with say they've seen maybe a fraction of the eligible voters in their districts coming by to come by and vote and do their civic duty. Now, here's what Clerk Karen Chilcott tells us about the situation. Typically for a municipal election, we are going to be looking at lower voter turnout. Uh, it is a very important election, however, because these are the people that are making everyday decisions about how to use your taxpayer money locally. So far, everything's been going very smoothly, uh, very seamless. We have a nice assembly line going here. Uh, out at the polls, the reports are that the, the poll paths are going on without any issues, no complaints. Yeah, now that of course those uh, all the voters here uh, do not include all the mail-in ballots that the county has received over the past few days and weeks of which there's uh, as of I was told this morning 18,000 uh, mail-in ballots here now of course if you still need to vote you can get out by 8 p.m. tonight and of course we'll have coverage on this all throughout tonight but for now live at the polling places Tom Kowalski here he is now.